how to use AI to make your portfolio website unique and beautiful for $10 or less. For a bit of background, I've been coding for a long time. So I've always had a website with my name on it. Uh, if I just go to screen.co, you can see that I like to play around with a couple of JavaScript and CSS things to make it look dynamic and interesting. But what I've always struggled with is how to present my projects. And as you can see, if I go to portfolio here, it's something. You can click these things, but in Safari, it's very laggy and buggy. It's only a wall of text. There's not really any imagery here. It just doesn't look like I know anything about design. And I wanted to change that. So here's the tools that I use to achieve that. The first one is called Bento. And you can just go to bento.me, create your own page. Um, I'm going to do that right now to showcase exactly what I did in the entire workflow. So we're going to create a temporary Bento link. Uh, what we need is a temporary email address. So we're just going to do that right here. And I will delete that once we're done so we're not clogging up Bento. Um, we're just going to do a test Twitter account and that should be good for now. Now the next thing we need is Midjourney because I want to use Midjourney to generate these cover images for every project that I've been working on. And to simplify that even more, I'm using ChatGPT to help me generate a prompt for Midjourney. Now all of that is getting siphoned into my Notion page where I can write a full write-up about all the projects I've done with a bit more detail and maybe a bit of imagery and links and whatever I want to talk about in the project. Uh, so let's get started. First up, what I'm going to do is open ChatGPT and tell it about a project that I've done. So what we're going to say is, give me a prompt for a graphical illustrator. You should write one sentence for them to illustrate a graphic to promote a product. And now this is all you need before getting the description of your project. So the thing we're going to do now is for my master thesis, I wrote something called Bionode. Bionode is a cloud hosted container workflow engine that allows biologists to run workflows in the cloud easily and at scale. Now I have access to GPT-4 because I subscribe to ChatGPT+, and I also subscribe to Midjourney so I can use version 5, but you could do all of this for free. ChatGPT is 20 bucks a month, Midjourney is 10 bucks a month. Now you get this beautiful sentence here, a futuristic, scientific, effortly orchestrating, blah, 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 bunch of stuff. All you do is pump it into Discord, into the Imagine command, and then you get something like this. Um, you can get a couple of different variations, you can choose one. Here I did it in a different aspect ratio with version 5, and I really like this one here in the bottom right. So what we're going to do is upscale it, and then we can click it here, uh, open it on the web, now my face is in the way, and we can download it. And then I'm actually going to face here to say open browser, save, go. And then all we need is to create a new Notion page for this. So this one is going to be called BioNode. And I will be putting in the image that we just created. And then here we can describe our project. Lastly, we just click the share button. We want to share it to the web, copy the web link, and then we head back to Bento. Now I can just paste this link on this page um, and we can give it a new, a new title. Let's call it bio node. And then we can also add, uh, where is the plus button? I think I still need to skip this. Yes, we can add a new picture here and just put in the image that we just generated, upload it, and then we can make it a little bit bigger. This can now be your bio note section. Maybe you want to add a new section header for this. We have contact on here. And then do the projects up there. This one goes here, Twitter goes down below. And you can see how you can build your little bento box. And you can drag these around, build a little preview of every project. Maybe you want to do it horizontal. And then you can stack these up. 
Uh, and that's all you need. This is now going to be linked on my website as soon as people click portfolio. And I can give you a little preview of what mine looks like right now. So I have a bunch of different projects that I all arranged in this little grid here. I created an image with Midjourney for all of them. And I've been prompting Midjourney through ChatGPT. So it's really end-to-end -end machine learning to achieve this. And I think that's pretty genius. Well, I hope this helped you. And I'm looking forward to see your portfolios.